Hey guys, it's Nierke. Um Today we're going to cover the Razer Sound Moza Gaming Mouse. It uses the 3G infrared sensor from Razer, um, 1800 DPI. And the bottom of the mouse on our left side here, you can change the DPI between 800 to 1800 with the flick of the switch. On the right side, that, that little switch is for the pulling rate, you can change that if you want to. And the sensor is perfectly balanced, it's perfectly centered in the mouse. So it's really nice and it feels great. Nice Teflon feet. Seven foot cord, it's a tangle free cord. Razer is famous for their, their large click buttons and the sound mode does not disappoint. Rubberized scroll wheel, feels great, easy to move. I've tested this mouse on the Razer Destructor as well as the Steel Series QCK Plus. Tracks flawlessly. If you notice in some of the, the laser mice these days, if you move your hand really fast, your crosshair might spaz out, like it might jump up or down. Um, does not do that on this mouse. It's amazing. If I had to compare the sound mostly to another mouse on the market, I would pick the Logitech G3. Very similar size, very similar feel. The Razer mouse is still a little bit lighter. Only drawback I can think of, no thumb buttons. Come on, we need thumb buttons in our mice. I've read some reviews of people complaining that uh, the click buttons tend to squeak after a while. I've had this mouse for about a month now, no problems at all, and I play a lot with it. The sound mouse overall, it's a really good mouse. It's very inexpensive. Um, I think I paid about $40 for it uh, at uh, Future Shop. Overall, it's a very good mouse. Um, I'm gonna rate it 8 out of 10. Uh, it's not a bad rating. I'd actually rate it a little bit higher if it had thumb buttons. Feels great, tracks great, looks great, 